One of the crucial bases of reform in any country is the transformation of the educational system. Nevertheless, the foundation to transformation is professional development. In the current educational context, we as educators need to be aware and be as quick in our development as the fast-paced growth of the general knowledge, as well as the changes in the skills required to build and maintain prosperous societies. In this project, I was honored to take part in the development of the training material. And one of the main targets set was implementing inquiry-based strategies. The activities designed for the professional development sessions not only reinforced the inquiry-based approach that the resources were ordered upon, but also made use of adequate, innovative teaching learning strategies. Therefore, such professional development projects deepen the knowledge and understanding of the participants in inquiry-based approach, allowing them to practice the needed skills and consequently drive this pedagogy to our classrooms. After all, any effective training impacts practicing classrooms. In this century, the consensus that life must go on has prevailed. Regardless of the novelty and the sheer weight of the hurdles the pandemic has pre presented us, this approach has helped us to readjust very quickly. It allowed us to surpass contemporary issues and geographic distances. To be fully honest, I'm a person that highly values the importance of direct face-to-face -face contact. However, even for someone like me, I cannot help but be amazed by the extent of how much more could be achieved by developing training materials and conducting sessions in a well-designed virtual environment. The interactive platform developed by our highly specialized IT team, the educational applications, the educational games that were designed and developed based on inquiry-based learning approach, along with the interactive activities authored by Cambridge Partnership for Education, were impeccable educational resources. They allowed us to deliver the material in an interactive, entertaining, personalized manner, and to maintain constant channels of communication between participants. The critical issue in virtual training sessions is the internet speed requirements and the bandwidth. Some trainees might not feel at ease or be engaged while communicating in a virtual medium. And this makes building bonds among participants more challenging. Well, surely the interactive training platform helped a lot to overcome some of these limitations. Otherwise, I can just think of the only limitation. I see the fact that we miss going out together for a coffee after finishing sessions because for me it is the time when participants can more freely present their unique perspectives. Since teaching methodologies are continuously being updated and improved, professional development is paramount to revitalize an educator's career. We need to guarantee access to high quality and holistic education we need to enable our teachers and constantly enrich their capabilities so they can in turn be able to educate our future generations and allow them to unlock their full potentials. Reforming education is the transformation of our future and shaping it towards the better. When an educational system enhances the development of lifelong learners, the critical thinking of self-learning individuals, and uh, subsequently develops independent leaders, then we can confidently say that educational system impacts not only the present, but also the future.